What's up, weirdos? Today we are playing Big Head. I don't know where we're getting this big head from, but look at that fella. He's on a date. Mar Maricel? Is that is that her name? Marcel? Uh Saturday night again. Background music and the TV. I really enjoy being with you and having a good time. That was the end of that other sentence. I thought we were saying something about the TV. No? Okay. No matter that our house doesn't have a roof, any place is fine if we're together. We don't we don't have a roof either. Seems like a problem whenever it rains. Roman? Is is that my name now? Look at my face, dude. Why is it jiggling like that? Anyway, I love you too, and I've I've waited all week for this moment to come. And sit down and enjoy it. 30 year old trashy horror movie. Great. I like those ones too, they're not bad. Unfortunately, it's not raining, or things would get wet. Of course, that's how that works. Not having a roof is complicated, but the rent is so cheap. I bet, uh, bet you got mold everywhere. The forecasters ain't predicting rain, and you know they always get it right. I don't know how they do it. Roman, hello? It's true, I love the forecasters, they always get it right. What would we do without them? Uh, probably get everything wet. Nothing bad can happen tonight. We have to enjoy. My head hurts a little bit. Could you make me some li linden tea? Is that is that what that tea's called? Linden? Okay, I'm coming, love. I don't like... What are we watching? What the f... Oh, what are we watching? What is that? What are we doing? Okay, okay. I don't know no damn horror movie that that just uh is doing that. Is this the kitchen right here? We really don't have a roof, do we? And we're like not on the first floor like at all. We're at the very top, aren't we? Yeah, like the very, very top. That is crazy. My cup? With a mug. I can use it to make tea for Roman. Great, great. Where's the where's the tea? It's not gonna be in the fridge, I know. There's a lemon. There's only one lemon left to squeeze. No problem, no problem. I don't know what that tells me. Tea! Linden tea. First I have to heat the water. Would be great if you fucking told me in that minute. The kettle, yeah, no shit. Okay. Hot water, do nothing. Heat water. First I turn on the stove. The flame looks kind of orange. Could be dangerous. Was orange good and blue bad? I never remember. Pretty sure it's blue bad. It's false. No way. Er. Blue bad. You're wrong. Sulfuric acid. Okay. We should, we should buy one of those fancy electric kettles when we have money. Sure. Eat away. I'm waiting. We're really just waiting for water to boil, aren't we? I have to visit my mom next week. Didn't ask. I've been p postponing it for two months already. Well, it, it's, it's your mom. You should probably go see her. I don't think you would be postponing for two months if you actually cared about your ma. Press E to continue waiting. No problem. We'll wait. There's a little kettle thing in the top left corner. I didn't notice that. Would you look at that? It takes too long to boil. I'm getting anxious. Really. Press E to continue waiting. Will do. We're waiting. It'll it'll get warm. I bet. That bar is not getting any higher. Is it ready? No. No. The water is hot and ready to make tea. Are you sure about that? It didn't it didn't go off. Um are we pouring the water in there? A mug, I can use it. Okay, get fucked. Tea? Linen, grab tea bed? I'm doing this while holding. Okay, I could have been doing this while I was waiting. Yeah, put tea bag, pour water. All right, the tea is ready. D did we just craft it on a crafting table? Dude, this mug, don't know how it's holding water right now. This is crazy. Okay, here you go, Roman. You know, 
think something might be wrong with that headache you got going on. Here, drink this tea, drink this tea. Magic tea make head go small. Oh, the big head hurt! Oh, sorry, head, <laughs> my head hurt. <laughs> I must be getting sick. Something's going on. Is my head big? Could you say I have a big head? Maybe, maybe. I can't believe it. I just had to get sick on the weekend. Really, really. Uh, check if I have a fever. The thermometer is in the bathroom. Okay, no problem. Uh, good thing I'm grabbing the thermometer. I don't want to put my hand on that head. I don't know if it's contagious. I don't want a big head like that. You kidding me? It's got weird veins on it. Can I call someone to help out? Don't need to call anyone right now. Well, you just might have to here in a little bit. Let's see, uh, this little weird cabinet right here. Cool. Grab the thermometer. Yes. Yes. Close. No. Someone in my tub? Hope not. I don't see anybody. Here we go. What the fuck type of good decor is? Never mind. Okay. Mm, yep. Oh, dude. I think it's getting a little worse. Um, maybe the tea had something in it. I don't know what. Check if I have a fever. Okay. Um, everything is gonna be fine. Don't worry. That it must be the flu. I think that's a little bit more than the damn flu. Uh, here you go. Press E to wait. I'm just gonna stare at you while you're writhing in pain with that massive noggin of yours. Holy shit. Your head is indeed a bit bigger, but not that much. Okay, um, wait, we must have seen this before. Is this a normal occurrence? Is this a thing that happens? The Roman needs to see, like, a professional right now. Are you kidding me? If you're still feeling bad, we can go to the hospital. But you're just now suggesting that? I would suggest that whenever we were in the pre-big head error. Uh, you know what I mean? Whenever he wasn't quite as big headed. I would have been rushing them somewhere. The thermometer has taken the temperature. You have a raging fever. I can't take it anymore. My head is going to explode. Bring the pills from the bed bedside table. Uh, we'll do, we'll do. You're turning into a grandpa. I don't know what's going on. Um, are these your pills? That's a radio. Uh, where are your pills at? I feel like we should have them out everywhere. Painkillers? Really? You're, you don't have any medication for this disease that you have? Holy shit! Oh my gosh! You know, your, your, your head's mighty large. I don't think this is, this is enough. I feel like my brain is trying to escape through my eyes. My head feels heavy. It's hard to keep it on my shoulders. I'm starting to think this might not be normal. You haven't had this happen before? It's probably best to call an ambulance. Call an ambulance, I'm about to faint. There you know. Probably should have done that at stage two, big head. Um, I'm not gonna lie. Let's call the ambulance. Get to call him right now. You for waiting for them to answer. No problem. We're waiting. It's not an emergency, you know. We'll be on hold for a while. Come on, come on, answer. It's an emergency. Okay, we've changed the stakes. She didn't seem very, um, very, uh, Urgent before whenever he was having the mega mind going on <laughs> I need an ambulance and they don't answer <laughs> Yep, that's how it is continue waiting you call 911 you, you make sure you got the right number um, Nothing Operator good evening. What emergency assistance do you need? Uh, Operator good evening. Yeah, uh, my husband has a very large head a very large head, you say? Your husband has a very large head? Yes, excessively large. I need an ambulance. Man, all services are currently overwhelmed. Something is going on. We're receiving hundreds of calls saying that people have big heads. Very big. You'll have to stay calm and wait for everything to pass. 
Find a safe place and stay away from people with big heads. It could be contagious. As far as we know, it's happening all over the country. In addition to the floods. Floods? What <laughs> floods? I have to free up the line. Sorry. I can't believe you're not going to help us. Floods? <laughs> what do you mean, floods? Oh, well, we... Yeah, we don't have a roof. Um... Oh! Uh... Hey... Hey, um... Roman, you okay? You okay, Roman? Uh, the emergency? Oh, uh, I see that. Your eyeball's a little... Is your eyeball okay? Is that eyeball okay? Um, I know that one's working at least somewhat. How's it hanging? I am so sorry. What am I supposed to do about that? Alright, big old potato head. You're, you're gonna stay right there. I'm gonna figure something out, maybe. Oh. What? Uh, Chango? It's the perfect hiding spot. Alright, hide in the closet. I can't do it. Roman needs my help. I'm scared. But I can't leave it there alone. Roman has turned into an it. No longer he. What kind of person would do that? Roman? Are you behind me? Chango 2. Roman's favorite video game. Cool. Great. Well. Sorry, Roman. I, mean, I just went into the other room to see what was up. Are you okay? Do I really have to stand this close to you? They were wrong! Marcel! How can that be? What? What are you talking? What are you talking about? I'll help you. Roman, you'll be fine. Hang in there. Those damn forecasters! What? We got it wrong! It's raining! All our things are wet. What's going on? Roman, are you okay? Well, what the fuck? Um... I can't read that. Yep. Um. I am a brain. I, th that's what that says. Cool. Alright. Yep. Can't read any of that. Uh. Is he melting me? Is I melting? What is happening? Roman turned into a giant brain? And now what am I? Hello? Uh... Are we giant brains together? Your body's jiggling all the hell. Dude. Um... Are you still attached to it? What are we doing? He's ascending. He's, um... No longer needs this mortal realm. Oh, there's another one behind him, and another one. And we are rising. Okay, well, you, we, I bet we're one of them too. That's a lot. That's a lot of people with Roman's disease. I gotta say, um, Roman may have been sleeping around a little bit. Uh, how did all these people catch his disease? I was the closest one to him. Uh, cool. Cool. We're just floating. Big old floaters going around. Okay. I can chill. I can dig it. Cool. Straight floating. Nothing. Nothing else going on. Just big brains on the move. Okay. What is that? What what the hell is that? What am I supposed to do with that? Oh well. 
that was big head. Um, Roman, uh, you have a mighty large skull. Uh, but if you enjoyed, please share it with a friend who thinks I also enjoy. Send it to someone who you think has a giant head. Okay, send it to the massive mega mind in your life. Okay, thank goodness for those people because without them we wouldn't have any floating brains. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please have a gnarly day and leave a like on this video. Like, subscribe to all those things because you made it to the end with Roman the big head. And I, I can't help you if he comes after you unless you subscribe. So you gotta subscribe, otherwise you'll get the big head disease and then more people will be sitting near this video because now you're known as the big head guy in the group so can't do anything about it y'all know they did thank you guys so much for watching i really do appreciate it and i will see you in the next one see ya